Hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is RJ. So today we're doing a quick update. So this is sort of like a bonus video. Normally I'll do my regular video on a Tuesday, but uh, I came across this and it's uh, connected with the video I recently posted about the lightning node. So I just thought I'd put I'd throw this on here uh, as soon as possible uh, just to give you a bit of uh, updated info. Uh, but for start, first off. I have to ask, I mean, I don't know if this is just me overworking or something, or maybe you guys out there have had this uh, before, but last night I, woke, I had this really bizarre dream. So I'm at a, a, bu uh, a business uh, lecture, like a, a conference, and I'm traveling back to my hotel uh, with these uh, two uh, women that uh, are colleagues and that they've been on the conference with me. And anyway, I get back in my room. I'm in my, like I'm in my hotel room and down the hall in a uh, like a real distant, I can, I can hear Elvis burning love. And anyway, and I just, and I just sort of humming it and then I start singing it and then I'm absolutely like really belting it out. And then I woke up. It was absolutely bizarre. And then I've had that song in my head all day. Uh, it's just absolutely crazy. Anyway, I thought that I'd just share that with you. It's just, uh, I tell you, bizarre. I love that tune though. I do love that tune. I just have no idea why it popped into my head in that. I just think maybe I, I just work, I'm working too hard. Anyway, okay. So basically on with the video. So as you can see, this is the Bellina Etcher. In the Lightning Node video uh, I recently did about updating the OS, I suggest using this to basically um, burn the image of the OS onto your SD card. Okay, so uh, basically, uh, I came, what I came across is that Raspberry Pi have their own image builder so basically it's really cool actually so obviously the fact that you you're burning it onto a raspberry pi this might just do a slightly better job obviously it works exactly the same so you choose your image you choose your sd card and then you hit right the burning process is around about the same amount of time as the Bellina etcher but the, but this um this app has some really cool features as well. So if you click on OS, you can, it actually has the Raspbian OS. Basically, if you click that, it will automatically download it and burn it straight to your disk. Uh, you can also uh, basically erase, obviously erase your SD card before you start off with. You can uh, pick up other Raspbian based images um, you can you you can um, do this, which is obviously connected with uh, Kodi, uh, and you can use obviously a custom image as well. And if we go in here, uh, they also have the uh, basically if you have a Raspberry Pi 4 and you have a problem with uh, booting the OS, then they do have a recovery option here in here as well, which is brilliant. But ba but don't use that unless you're instructed to use that. Uh, okay, so that's, you know, it's just a quick uh, brief rundown. If we go to the website, so this is basically where you get the downloads from. So you've got Windows, you've got Mac, and you've got Ubuntu. Ubuntu. Um, so they are all the OSs you can uh, download this for. Uh, again, it talks about the recovery uh, in on your uh, Pi 4 if you have an issue and sort of the processes to go through. And then down here, you have some really cool things as well so the like little little projects I mean you can uh, create uh, use this to create a weather station out of your Raspberry Pi uh, you can um, sort it out so basically you can put uh, Windows 10 onto your Raspberry Pi uh, and various other things uh, and I just thought I'd bring that to you just as a real real quick update uh, and you know so that's it really at the end of the day so it just like I said I didn't want to take up too much of your time just a quick uh, you know like I say use that uh, if you're going to be use, uh, burning any sort of Raspberry Pi images because it's Raspberry Pi's actual image burner there just might be some better ca compatibility issues when it comes to burning the image uh, so like I say um, I'm going to leave it there so if you're new to the um, my channel and you want to learn more about um, the lightning node uh, and how to build a lightning node uh, check out the links 
uh, below the description uh, I'll put a couple of older videos in there and uh, I'll put three videos in there now I'm going to put in how to build the first update after the build and then I'm also going to put the most recent upgrade into version 1.4 so go and check those out and if you want to learn more about how to earn cryptocurrency for free about cloud mining sites about crypto investments and lots of other crypto related stuff hit the subscribe button and don't forget to tag that notification bell and if you could smash that like button it really helps me which then helps me bring more content to you guys so take care have a great day and i'll speak to you soon thanks a lot bye